Hello everyone, today I'd like to present our paper Local Dampening Differential Privacy for Non-Numeric Queries via Local Sensitivity. I am Victor Farias from Federal University of Ceará and this work was done in collaboration with our friends at at and Labs Research. First, I'd like to introduce some concepts of differential privacy. The intuition behind differential privacy is that the participation of any single user in the published data should be near indistinguishable. Differential privacy anonymizes the answer for any query issued to the database for public use, and we call that process a differentially private mechanism. It is designed such that an attacker cannot re-identify our friend's myth that had its data collected in the data collection step to compose the database. More formally, a differentially private mechanism is a randomized algorithm that produces the answer to a given query. Differential privacy imposes a constraint on the randomized algorithm. So, for any two neighboring databases, where neighboring databases are databases that differ in only one user, so for every two neighboring databases, the probability of outputting an answer O for database X should be similar to the probability of uh, the same mechanism outputting O for the neighboring da database X prime. More specifically, they are bound by a multiplicative factor of the exponential of epsilon, where epsilon is our privacy budget that controls the level of privacy in the mechanism. Now, we show how differential privacy is applied to the non numeric queries. Non-numeric queries are queries that produce a categorical output. For example, the question, what is the dominant clothing color, is a non-numeric query. The range of this query is blue, green, red, and gray. Those are, those are the possible outputs for this query. In the non-numeric differential privacy setting, now the query needs to provide a score of how useful an answer is. For example, the uh, utility of, an, of the answer blue is 5 because we have 5 people with blue clothes. Then the utility of green is 2 because we have 2 people with green clothes and so on. In the setting, the exponential mechanism is the most well-known method to provide differential privacy. Specifically, it achieves differential privacy by perturbing the output with noise. The exponential mechanism, it samples um, an answer R from the range with probably probability proportional to this. So this is the exponential of the privacy budget, the utility score, over two times delta U, where delta U is the global sensitivity. Let's talk more about the global sensitivity. The global sensitivity measures the maximum difference of utility scores between every pair of neighboring databases. So the larger the uh, global sensitivity, more noise we add and less utility and accuracy we have. And the opposite is also true. For instance, the global sensitivity of this query, what is the dominant clothing color, is 1. Because adding or removing an individual from this database will change the utility score of any color by just 1. So what we want is low sensitivity. So our research question is, can we reduce noise by using a better notion of sensitivity or a smaller notion of sensitivity? To answer to that question, we present the local dampening mechanism. Here we propose new sensitivity notions as the local sensitivity, local sensitivity at distance t, and the element local sensitivity at distance t. Those sensitivity definitions are new to the non-numeric setting, and they are also smaller or equal than the global sensitivity. Thus, we can define our local dampening mechanism that uses those notions of local sensitivity. And also, it leverages 
them to build a more accurate mechanism. The local dampening mechanism samples an answer R from the range with probability proportional to this. So this is the exponential of the epsilon, our privacy budget, times the dampen utility function. So D is our dampening function. So our dampening function D dampens the utility function using the notion of local sensitivity such that the resulting dampened utility function has low sensitivity and consequently has higher accuracy. Comparing the local sensitivity mechanism to the exponential mechanism, the difference is the red term in the probability. If we put some examples of this term on the axis, we have this. So the distance from the best score, the red point, is further apart from the rest on the local dampening mechanism compared to the exponential mechanism. This means that the probability of sampling the best answer, the red dot, is higher in the local dampening mechanism. This implies in a higher accuracy. For some applications, the utility function is correlated to the local sensitivity. For this case, we have a second version of the local dampening mechanism, which is the shifted local dampening mechanism. It works the same way as the standard local dampening mechanism, but before dampening, we shift the utility function, so we can leverage this correlation. To show the accuracy of our approach, we apply the local dampening mechanism to the influential node analysis application. The task is, given a graph, we would like to release the label of the top k most influential nodes. Specifically, we use the concentric between centrality as centrality metric and also as the utility function. We test three mechanisms, the exponential mechanism EM prime top k in red, uh, the local dampening mechanism in LD prime top k in blue, and the shifted local dampening mechanism in SLG prime top k in black. We tested for k equals 5, 10, and uh, 20 for the data sets Aaron, DBLP, and GitHub database. This is an application where the utility function is correlated to the sensitivity. So in this case, um, the shifted local dependent mechanism, as we would expect, outperformed the other two mechanisms. And more specifically, it reduces uh, the use of privacy budget by two to four orders of magnitude when compared to the exponential mechanism. So here are the conclusions of our work. We introduced new notions of local sensitivity to the non-numeric setting. We propose a novel differentially private mechanism for non-numeric queries using local sensitivity. This approach reduces noise. It is a basic building block for more complex algorithm, and it is as generic as the exponential mechanism. So anywhere where the exponential mechanism is used, we can also use our approach, the local dependent mechanism. We tested two applications. The first one is the influential node analysis, where we had a reduction by two to four orders of magnitude of the privacy budget. And the second application is the decision tree induction. We skipped that application here in this presentation, but the listen can uh, check it out in our paper. In that application, we had up to 8% of accuracy improvement. Thanks for your attention. Feel free to ask me any question in the Q&A section and also feel free to reach me in this email. Thank you very much.